Hi guys, welcome to Jazz Journey. My name is Jasmine. Thank you so much for selecting this video. On this video, we're gonna be going inside and open two different boxes. This is the first time for me. It's funny because the last month I canceled my premium box, but this month, uh, it was a mistake actually. I joined one of them, joined the wait list on March 31st the day before and I was so surprised that I was off the wait list I didn't think that was gonna happen that's the reason why they joined and I, like, I want to get the, the premium box but let me just go ahead and do it on both of my accounts and before you know it I had two boxes but it's okay because what I'm gonna be doing is I'm gonna be doing a giveaway a lot of the items that I get on different boxes so guys if you're interested in that giveaway from a lot of those products from BoxyCharm um, just go ahead and subscribe to my channel so you don't miss out on that on that upcoming video so I have two different boxes we're gonna be uh, unboxing the first one as you see the theme is BoxyCharm and it says festival vibes the value of box A I have to label them that that way so uh, I don't get confused which card is for which one. And box A, the value of this box is $242. So I am still waiting for a two base box. And that's something that if you are considering getting the premium box, you need to be active with the base box. That means you're gonna be two separate charges. So right now at this time, what we're going through, what everybody's going through in the world, it wasn't the best thing for me, but that's why I'm doing a giveaway. It didn't work out how I thought it was gonna be, um, but in the meantime, I'm gonna share that with you guys. So in the bottom, if you see that your box is backwards, then you could go ahead and follow the rules because uh, they're gonna be giving a 1,000 curated box to one winner who received the box, and I did not get that one. So if you did, go ahead, guys, and don't miss out on that opportunity. If you got the box that says Hello Charmers backwards, I'm going to be showing you a picture of that event that is happening right now. Uh, so what do I get? The first thing is Smashbox LA Cover Shot. This is an eyeshadow palette. It's very pretty. Very, uh, as you know, this was spoiler number one. Yes, I do like to do give, uh, videos about spoilers. Um, but so far, I feel like... I'm not going to do it as much because it is a hard time and the last thing you're going to be looking at is spending money on something that is not really an essential so it is a hard for a lot of people for a lot of us we do need to have a budget and make sure that we put our money to that uh, so that's why i'm kind of like cutting back on on the uh, spoilers but this was one of the spoilers there was going to be a four variations and it was going to be three palettes and the other one's going to be the pharmacy potion but look at this palette. I didn't know it did that. Uh, look how pretty it is. I am not going to swatch it because I'm going to be giving this palette away. The retail price for this palette is $45. Look how pretty it is. And this palette, it says, is a late cover shot eye palette. And it comes with a full size liner inside. So not only you're getting the palette, but you're also getting an, a liner, a full size. These are the shades, so pretty. And then you see the mirror. What's the retail price for this? The retail price for that is $45. The next product is from Peach and Lily. Peach and Lily, this is called the Good Acids uh, Pore Toner Gently Exfoliate and Rate Plus Balance. And it's an AHA Plus Turmeric. This one retails for $39. And one thing that I do like about this is that once I introduce acids in my skin, in my skincare routine, it does help exfoliate and it even smooth canvas which is your skin um, but sometimes when you do too much of it it could irritate it it could inflammate your skin uh, so what they're saying that this toner it has a perfect balance of AHA that is gentle enough that you could use it every day and it's not gonna uh, create that uh, it's not gonna irritate your skin uh, so that means that you could use it every day and look at the I really like the packaging so I'm excited to try this uh, tonight and tomorrow this is libido this has grapefruit seed melissa and avocado this is h away replenishing cream uh this is the company from israel and this is inspired by nature uh look at the packaging it's so pretty and it says it has extras from 11 pure plants i didn't think i was gonna get this because it does say that it's good for dry to normal skin and my skin is oily and sensitive so i didn't think i was gonna be getting this product but i'm gonna be giving this to my husband yes i'm i'm trying to help him include some stuff in his skincare routine because i'm like you and he has dry skin so i think this will look will work perfect for him what is the retail price for that the retail price is 69 dollars for that cream next let's go in and move into the igk uh, this is called good behavior smoothing spray i was the one that i did not like getting uh hair care products 
in my boxy looks because so I felt like boxy looks should be uh, skincare, should be makeup, but I did not like getting hair products. Then I got the IGK hair mask, and it is from the same brand. OMG, that really, really helped my hair. My hair is frizzy. Uh, we get a lot of humidity in Florida, and uh, no matter what you do, it still gets a little frizzy. That mask really does help. I did a review about it because I really love that mask. So now I am not so... It doesn't bother me if I get hair care products. So this is another product that I read so many good reviews about. Uh, this works like keratin. And I remember I have a, a, a family member that does keratin for years, um, but I know it's kind of like a chemical somewhat that you're putting on your skin, on your hair. And I was off by that, I was put off by that. Um, so this will give you that result of keratin that gives you that streak, smooth, shine hair um, without the actual um, routine that you have to go through. And it is a very expensive a type of treatment that you put in your hair so I'm gonna try it out at first and see how it works on my hair because I really want to improve my hair um, but um, I'm excited that I got this product so that's IGK and the pro the price for that is $32 the next product I did get is from Too Faced I'm, I got this in my other box so I'm, I don't want to open it because I got the same shade and I already swatched the other one and I want to be giving this one away. This is from Too Faced. This is called Rich, Dass Rich and Dazzling High Shine Sparkly Lip Gloss. Uh, the shade for this one is the Hidden Talent. I thought I got a similar one in my Boxy Lux, so I thought it was going to be the same shade. But these are darker shade, as you see. Uh, so I'm glad that I'm, I got one, but at, at least it's a different shade. This one retails for $21, and I really like Too Faced packaging. I really do. So this one is going for the giveaway. And last, I did get, and it's funny because I got this on my Boxy Lux too, I think back in December. This is from M uh, Green Grass, and this is an air dry oil spray. So it put, I don't know, I feel like a product that you could use for your hair, your skin, and your body. I don't know. I it just, I don't know how that works. I have not even tried it, but... I don't know, I'm considering once I kept reading more about it. So, uh, so this one is inspired by Greece. It has great uh, ingredients uh, in this in this product. And this one retails for $36. Try it. I don't, know, I don't know, if you guys tried it, let me know what you guys think about that product. Uh, so this is everything for box A. And this, this whole box, uh, the total came out to $242. And um, like I mentioned, I had two different um, weight. One was 2.7 and the other one was 3.1. So let's go ahead and move on to box B. And I like that even the foam is also the same color. Uh, I do keep those foams because every time I'm doing, uh, I'm doing my eye makeup, there's certain colors that kind of like the color just stays, the pigmentation is too strong. So I use these type of foam and I kind of like uh, clean my brush and then I pick a new color and I notice that really helps so that's what I keep them and I think I'm going to keep it for a DIY because I have so many of these I think I'm going to keep it for a DIY like to create like a foam and a bench I don't know it's just my thoughts how do you guys what do you guys do with those foams do you get rid of it do you use them just let me know okay so let's move on to box B in, in one of the eyes I wasn't wearing mascara because uh, I did put the mascara in one eye and then I did the other one on the other eye. So I'm going to be showing you the video. This is from Wonder Beauty. I really like this brand. This one is called Mile High Club. I don't know if I notice a big difference with this. I feel like I get a big difference with the Too Faced um, Better Than Sex Mascara. I feel like my lashes look so much fuller. This one retails for $26 and like it does say that it's going to give you volume and length mascara. So I don't know. So let's go ahead and move on with the other product. I am excited that I am getting this in my box. This is what I really wanted. Besides the palettes, I really didn't want, I didn't mind getting a palette, but I really wanted this product. I'm more into Korean skincare, and I really like this brand. And I do like this, that it has a spatula, and it's magnetic, so you will not lose it. I like that so much. And yeah, I like this mask. I, I can't wait to try it tonight. Uh, so how much does this cost this one costs 38 dollars they do come into different size in the sephora website this is a smaller size so this one costs 38 and this is like a renewal antioxidant hydration mask and is 
it's gonna give you that hydration that you need so I'm excited that I got this in my box the next item I did get was also the peach and lily um, I don't mind because my husband is uh, excited to try different things for his skincare so we might keep one of each I will have one and I have the other one so I'm excited that I got this I don't mind that that's a duplicate because as you see that cost $39 so uh, that almost paid for the box and I will I, if I need to stock up on I already have an extra one uh, so the next thing I got was the same product I also got the libido cream yep another duplicate I also got the IGK good behavior the same product so I might be giving that away because I don't know how you package that so I'll see how that work out and I also got the Too Faced. This is the one that I swatched. That's when it's open. And look how pretty. Oh my God, this is so, so pretty. So pretty. Uh, so I believe it's the same shade. Yes, it's Hidden Talent. That one we took for $21. And the last thing that I got was, like I mentioned, the mascara. So as you see, there's only like two different products in this box versus A and B. Uh, and you know what's interesting? I have been doing my quiz. I, I've been doing, I did my quiz um, middle of last year, ending last year, throughout this year. Uh, once again, once I saw a video about a few months ago, and I have, I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna do two different quiz, and the quiz I'm gonna have one that has more skincare that I want more skincare in my boxes, and the other one that I want more makeup. And I am not seeing a change at all. I'm seeing the same thing. As you see, the variation is very similar. They do keep saying that they're gonna go uh, go and use the quiz, but I don't know when that's gonna become uh, actual, when that's gonna be happening, um, because I haven't seen a change. I'm still getting duplicates anytime I buy, anytime I, I subscribe to, to boxes on the same month. What is the value of this box? The value of this box is a little bit less. This one is $225, while this one uh, was $242. Um, overall, what do I think about BoxyCharm Premium? I really like the box. Um, I did cancel last month for Fenty, so I didn't have a chance to make a choice. So everything that was here on my box was selected by BoxyCharm since um, I was last, I was on the wait list. But this month, I'm excited for what's coming for BoxyCharm Premium. I'm going to be showing you really quickly what's coming for BoxyCharm Premium. And in addition, uh, I don't know when the choice day is coming in a few days, actually. That's going to be on April 16th. So if you have BoxyCharm Premium and you're active, don't miss out on making your choice item if you're active. So, yeah, what do I think? I like what was in the box. I am not mad with it because there's some products here that I wanted to include in my skincare routine that I actually needed because I was running out on, on that. Um, but everything else, uh, as you know, I'm, I'm going to be giving some stuff away. So guys, thank you for watching this video. I hope you're staying safe. If you want to see spoilers, you still don't mind seeing spoilers. So you still want to say, you know what, let's take it a break a little bit because, you know, there's other things that are a priority. And right now I can put that in my budget uh, or I don't mind seeing spoilers to see what's coming in case I could make an exemption. Um, just let me know in the comment section. So guys, thank you for watching this video. Hope you're staying safe and until the next video. Bye.